welcome back to my channel my name is Minta and if you're new to this channel I do lots of beauty videos travel videos basically videos of my life so let me give you a big hug and join this family by clicking the subscribe button so today's video is going to be my May favorite and tell me about it it's already like June so that's basically like six months into 2019 I don't know where half the year flew by it's like freaking scary but I came across lots of favorites this month so I can't wait to share it with y'all so first things first if you have oily skin or like you're plagued by blackheads because I am I have so many blackheads on my nose no matter how many extractions how many nose strips whatever I do even staying clear of makeup I still get blackheads so I guess that's my life but I found like one of the best blackhead strips in the market that does not even hurt and it's so effective it's this one is the pathology breakup box it's a 3-in-1 acne treatment so it comes with like a whitehead patch a um, pimple patch but what I freaking love about this box is the blackhead strips so in this box there's three of the blackhead strips um, on my last one so it's a black strip where you put onto your nose where you just need to wet a little bit of it and then you stick it on and wait for about 5 to 10 minutes you just peel it off when you peel it off there's zero 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 pain zero irritation it's something that I really love about this whole blackhead patch because a lot of times when I use a blackhead patch I feel like it actually removes the top layer of my skin which is not very healthy for your skin layer so please please find a good blackhead patch this one is super gentle and it removes every single Thing in like your nose like everything that's stuck deep into your nose it pulls it out and you can see it's so satisfying it's one of the best blackhead patch that I've ever tried I highly recommend it I think you can purchase it online I'll see if I can find the link and link everything down below so the next product that I really enjoyed in the month of May is the Real Blemish Clear Serum and this is definitely not how it looks like when you buy it this is actually a professional packaging like this I was one of the first to try this serum right before it was launched into the market and to be honest, I didn't really like it at first because when I used it every single day, I used it on my face as the first serum. So it was really drying on my skin. I actually had a lot of flakiness, especially on my nose and my forehead because I guess that's where my skin is actually the driest. So after I tried it for that month, I was like, nah, I don't think this is right for me. And then this month came and I was like having my period. So I was freaking out like crazy. Like it was literally spreading and it was so scary. And I had no idea how to stop it because I don't use any pimple creams anymore and I barely have any breakouts after using Halo Beauty and Halo Beauty wasn't working at all so I was just like help so I just whipped this out every single day religiously I would apply it on my chin area here and this area so I would just apply it and then I will replenish the moisture bed with a heavy duty moisturizer and just one week like seven freaking days my breakout cleared up so I was just like oh this freaking bottle is a miracle and um, just use it as a spot control serum you don't apply it on your entire face because most of the time your entire face is not breaking out so just use it on areas where you need it most and now I'm officially hooked on this so I highly highly recommend this especially if you're facing acne problem another product which is skincare as well because I highly highly believe that skincare is the most important thing because your natural skin is the best makeup that you can wear so I've been trying this Sofina Internal Power Dodai Essence and I was shook when I was at the launch event because when you dispense this, it becomes like a nice fluffy foam. It's so luxurious, it's so soft. And I know how when it comes to foam, the first thing you want to do is like rub it in, the, in between your hands, but no nope, girl. That's not how the technology works. This is like freaking science in a bottle because this actually works as you rub it into your skin. When you rub it in between your hands, it's already working on your hands. So when you apply it on your face, nothing happens. This actually helps to increase your blood circulation. So we did like a zoom in thing on our capillary and we literally saw like our blood racing on our skin after applying this. So what you should do is to apply this directly onto your face and then massage it in. So it actually helps to increase the blood circulation in your skin so it increases the absorption of your other skincare and it's just basically like a wonder power in a bottle like I felt like my skin is more rejuvenated my skin felt softer my skin felt more bouncier it's kind of like a little tiny like bump that you need in your skincare so I highly recommend this if you already have a solid skincare and you just want to like make it better get the Sofina IP Dodai Essence because it's really really good 
Next up is something that I've been using daily ever since I got that in the press kit. It is the Laneige White Dew Tone Up Fluid. So I've never been a fan of Tone Up Fluid. I'm completely honest right here because I feel like Tone Up Creams make me super white and I'm just like, I don't want to look like a ghost. And I'm pretty tan because I went to the beach and like got this gorgeous tan. But this, this Tone Up Fluid is so natural. Like... I feel like it actually brightens up my skin, it makes me look slightly fairer but not too over the top so when I apply it, people will be like, oh winter, you look so much like fresher, you look bright, there's something about you. Somebody actually said that it's a boyfriend glow so I think this is like the trick to getting that boyfriend glow I guess. <laughs> so yeah, I've been using this every single day, I no longer put on foundation so all I do is put up this tone up fluid and like conceal areas where I need it most and what I love about this is it also has SPF 35 so it's not a lot but it's like an additional on top of your daily SPF so another makeup favorite that I like is the 3C multi eye color palette so this is a super basic palette like I know how many nude palettes do you need in your life but trust me this nude is freaking gorgeous so it's more of a warm nude palette and what I like about this is it's not too red so it actually goes on pretty like natural on your eyes I love it when I just need some makeup to look alive when I go and I don't want to spend like 30 minutes blending my eyeshadow all I do is just pop this on so my favorite two shades are this two I will always use it on my crease darkening up a little bit and this all over so it's just like super basic you can like pop this in your bag put this and fly this up the plane it's just so convenient and I highly recommend this palette especially to those who are new into makeup and you just want to try some nude basic looks it's just amazing last but not least of my favorites list is a hair tool and it is the GHD Glide. What I love about this is it gives you like silky smooth hair. Like look at this hair. All I did was to comb through with this comb and I got like perfect runway ready hair. So every morning, especially if I do not have time to like curl my hair and get ready, all I do is just comb this through my hair and it helps to untangle my hair and it gives such a beautiful shine. Like Nobody can give you a shine like GHD. That's all I have to say. I've tried tons of like straighteners, colors, um, hair dryer. Only GHD gives you this beautiful shine because of the heat that they have. It's super hot. Even after unplugging this, this whole base is still actually pretty hot. And I can actually like straighten my hair too. So yeah. Best investment ever. I freaking love this. So that's the end of my product favorites for the month of May but I have two films to recommend you and both are on Netflix because like the month of May was just like a month for me and I was binge watching Netflix to feel better about myself. Who's guilty? Who's guilty of that? Me. But yeah, I found two really nice suspense thriller movies that I really wish I can inflict into others. <laughs> psychotic <laughs> but yeah i'm just kidding this was actually recommended to me by my friend and the first film is actually called what if it's a season kind of show so there's 10 episodes and every episode you're on your edge of your seat you're always wondering what's going to happen you're always trying to guess what is this girl's end game what is she doing and why is she destroying everybody's life why is she being such a bitch and then you realize like oh she's actually a softy and then you realize like no she's not a softy and you're like what the whole film is just like twisted AF and even after season 1 to be honest I don't really know what's her endgame and what she went through all this for and so yeah that's pretty interesting and the next film that I want to recommend is called The Perfection and it's also on Netflix it's really really twisted it's a thriller suspense movie and you will always think that this girl is like the bad girl until you reach the end it's just like whoa mind blown it's twisted AF it's disgusting there's like gore there's like insects there's every single thing that you have you that triggers you it's inside so imagine like an entire black mirror season into one movie that's what you get and it's really really like exciting and i love the whole moral of the story even though it got super dark so that's the end of my main favorites i hope you guys enjoyed my product recommendations and my film recommendations basically i'm in like a psychotic bitch i love thriller films so yeah, I'll try to watch more PG films and recommend it to you guys for the month of June if I'm doing a June favorite. <laughs> so if you like this video, give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, do whatever you want. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye!